so today we're going to be trying some new recipes that include hot chocolate mix. <laughs> we're going to make homemade hot chocolate, hot chocolate pancakes, and <laughs> hot chocolate brownies. <laughs> yes, brownies as well. We're making our hot chocolate. All we really had to do was put two cups of whole milk and some sugar into a saucepan. And once it gets to 180 degrees, you add in some melted chocolate. Personally, I think a hot chocolate needs to be like a little bit sweeter. No. And I think that's why I tend to like not drink Starbucks hot chocolate in the winter. But it's good. Compliments to the shop. So right now we're making our hot chocolate brownies. And basically it's like a sugar cookie like recipe, like it's just sugar and butter and flour. And then you just add um, two packets of like instant hot cocoa mix to it. And it becomes this really nice light color. And then you add chocolate chips and you just put it in a pan, spread it all around. Put it in the oven. And then once you take it out, you put the rest of the chocolate chips on top so that it melts and creates kind of like a frosting. And then you can add marshmallows on top. It tastes like a blondy kind of, but more like sugary. It's not really hot cocoa, like I feel like that flavor yeah. got lost. And it's really like granulated from all the sugar. I don't know, I don't really like it very much. These are hot chocolate right pancakes. Now, boy. Looks like one. Um, they're kind of bland and they're really dense. Like it's hard to chew and like swallow it. I think it would be good if they amped up the chocolate in the recipe. Yeah, I think that like, or like add chocolate chips to it or something. Like this is just, this could be a plain pancake. Yeah. 